saya yakin uh, ini vaksin membuat saya uh, kebal penyakit ini, tapi juga mencegah saya uh, menyebarkan penyakit. I think I've gone to work for the past eight months now, feeling like every day I go in, I'm risking my family, I'm risking my own life. I was always very excited to go to work. And so I think there's like a little bit of resentment toward coronavirus basically for making me dislike my job. And so I was like very excited to make steps towards eliminating that part of not wanting to go to work and also making sure that like my loved ones were safe. Only side effect yang saya dapat itu paling uh, soreness di tempat yang disuntik uh, buat satu hari. Setelah itu oke. Okay. I was very sore the next day. 36 hours out from the vaccine, I felt a little body aches. I took, I think, just 400 milligrams of ibuprofen, and then I felt perfect sense actually. Menurut saya sangat kecil saat efek seorang dapat dapat reaction yang sangat uh, berbahaya. Kayak kayak saya pas dapat dos-dos pertama setelah disuntik, kita harus tunggu di ruang tunggu 15 menit buat pastiin kita nggak ada allergic reaction. For me personally, the benefits of being vaccinated outweigh the risks of possible, you know, side effects from the, the vaccine. I think it's way more likely that I get COVID and I'm, you know, end up in the intensive care unit or die than have a side effect from the vaccine. Jadi waktu kayak dulu pas uh, polio pertama kali ditemukan atau uh, kayak cacar air gitu, mereka consider kayak deadly uh, disease. Tapi setelah uh, vaksin ditemukan buat polio, akhirnya mereka dapat meredakan uh, penyebaran polio di dunia. So I hope, I hope a lot of people are reassured by seeing, you know, healthcare workers, by seeing their friends and family get vaccinated and like no bad things happening. <laughs> Dan saya juga tahu pasti orang udah mulai capek soalnya ini pandemik udah hampir 8-9 bulan. Uh, tapi menurut saya itu yang memang paling bagus buat uh, mencegah penyebaran uh, coronavirus.